What's up? We are 27 years. We are a rock band from Minnesota. I'm Sam. I play drums. I'm Wes. I play the bass. Conrad. Cello. My name's Lance, and I play guitar, and I'm a lead singer. We're very passionate about our original music, but we also respect other people's music. And, uh, the covers that we choose are the covers that we actually genuinely, for the most part, enjoy. And this is stuff that we like, so if we like it, that energy is going to be portrayed in the crowd. Tell you all a story about the Joker and the thief I say. Tell you a story about the Joker and the thief. I want everybody else to to understand and feel what we're feeling, and that's a, the greatest good of, of being a musician is is a, to try to get other people to feel what you feel. I, I could never imagine that the drug they were doing would be better than what I was doing. Sit down or sit on stage, and we play and we play and we play, and people just love it. They love it, and and we're entertainers at that point. It's just amazing being up on the same stage that these people I bought CDs from. That formed what, what I am now. It, it, it just it built that. music, but it's still hard rock music that's accessible. different rhythms, there's different progressions, there's different vocals. take my glasses off because I have terrible eyesight so I can't see anybody in the crowd. Helps take my mind off everything and just focus on playing notes that don't suck hopefully. Seven years started as a project between me and a buddy. All it was was just my music gear, and, and he'd come over and we would collaborate. Put out the first CD back in like 2008, and it was just, uh, it was a great experience for me, probably one of the greatest experiences of my life. That experience told me what I needed to be doing. With, with this latest record, The Hartle Sessions, which I'm, I'm very proud of, what we did was we took a basement that was completely dysfunctional and it had a really, really horrible backstory to it about a man, this is a true story, who uh, was very depressed. He ended up um, killing himself in the basement of his own home. So what we did was we built a recording studio, which I'm sitting in right now, in the same very basement.
is like as, as a songwriter, the, te- the most terrifying thing in the world is, is writing a song and presenting it to essentially a bunch of strangers. support local music there's a plethora of solid musicians out there and they're your neighbors they really are yeah. and there's so many good people out there and, and it's a everybody feeds into the uh, the mainstream whatever you hear on the radio they, there's so many good musicians out there so many good bands just go see them man not to confuse the top 40 because <laughs> there are right but there is put us on the top wild. 40 bitches <laughs> <Ryan Seacrest. laughs> wanna be top 40 <laughs>